To make sure they stabbed the right people, Britons formed into primitive gangs called tribes. And like many gangs, they got into graffiti, vandalising the countryside with gigantic doodles, like this badly drawn horse, or this decorative pervert. Before Snapchat, hills were the most efficient way to distribute dick pics to a wide audience. As a result, this site at Cern Abbas became the second crudest hill in British history, after Benny. There's disagreement about how old the Cern Abbas giant actually is, especially since he's still young enough to get wood. What's not in doubt is that he represents the birth of British art, being the biggest example of a noble visual tradition that's echoed down the ages. But this happy land of spikes and hill filth was about to come under threat from something nobody saw coming, Romans. Where did the Romans come from? To begin with, they came from Rome, and then they came from the Roman Empire. Right, but where in Britain did they come from? Not from Britain. They came from Rome, which is in Italy. Right, well, this is about the history of Britain, so... Where in Britain did they come from? Well, the Romans came from Rome, and they headed northwards and conquered most of Europe. And then they crossed the English Channel and they conquered about half of Britain. And uh, where did they go once they were in Britain? Well, they tried to get to Scotland, but they decided it wasn't worth the effort of going there. Yeah, I felt that. <laughs>